Okay, so hello everyone. Um, it's been a while since I've done a, a YouTube video. Um, probably the last one I did was uh, the one on my new flip cam uh, in which I was at uni, just like explaining my situation and that sort of thing. Um, but I'm not really too happy with how that video came out. Um, it was a problem with the software because I don't really have the decent enough software to edit it so when the video got published it came out very very out of sync so the audio I think was way in front of the video footage so I was a bit upset about that but hopefully I can get that sorted Ooh, excuse me. hopefully I can get that sorted and I'll have some more videos up like as soon as possible sort of thing onto um, my channel because I would like to do more videos as I did explain in that one I would like to do a kind of video diary like maybe like every couple of days during the week or once a week depending on how busy I am just so I can update you lot and to update myself because half the time I'll forget the things that I've done anyway <laughs> um, but yeah so um, not much really has happened since uh, my last video except that I am now finished on my second year of uni so I'm extremely pleased um, so I'm a lot more happier now that I've actually handed in all my work and I don't have any uni until September now so that's good um, I have actually now moved back home to my parents house in Crawley uh, well put it this way the London house that we were in it it was okay, it was a big learning curve, but we just couldn't stay there over the summer, it would have been a bit too much, so at least while I'm here I can rest and relax down before my third year, which I kind of would like to do, but um, while I'm here um, I'm looking for a job, sort of in Crawley, Gatwick, Redhill, just Brighton, anywhere, like in Sussex, so... I'm keeping an eye out for any openings and stuff so hopefully I can get a job eventually just to keep myself a little bit busy while I'm here but um, it'd be quite good so I'm quite excited about being back here actually it's just it's been a crazy year already and this year's still going to progressively get crazier once I get into my third year so I'm excited but last night I uh, went 10 pin bowling for the first time in about four months. I haven't had any bowling since about midway through January, I think, or something like that. But, oh, put it this way, I was not expecting much at all. I was only expecting to get about a 490 series, which is about a 160 something average or something like that. But I was really like kind of putting myself down beforehand, thinking, oh, you know there's no point in having massive expectations for tonight because I haven't bowled for four months you know I haven't had any practice so you know I kind of set my standards quite low but um I had an amazing time last night absolutely amazing best night of bowling by far that I've ever had um I was bowling with my dad and my boyfriend came to watch as well and we started on 15 and 16 and well put it this way um we had about three breakdowns in the first game so we didn't even finish the first game within one hour normally within an hour we would have done about two games pretty much but no we had to wait ages um, but uh, eventually the pair next to us um, they only had two people rather than four so we swapped over to their lanes afterwards because apparently ours would need to take about two to three hours to um, to fix and we couldn't have that when uh, someone on the other team needed to get away kind of soonish because they had a double shift or something that evening but but still regardless of the problems that that had caused um, actually I kept the standard that I'd already had and just kept it going considering the lanes were quite different but it just blew me away last night um, considering not bowling for four months I had a 184 a 215 and a 224 for a 622 series <laughs> I was absolutely gobsmacked when I worked out that it was a 600 series because 
I haven't had one for over two years and I've always been working fairly hard to get my 600s and last night it felt like no effort at all although I really could feel myself pushing myself to just keep going and oh, I was the best night I just kept, I kept my dad going as well at one point because he was struggling he had about he had a couple of opens and then he struck out uh, he struck out and got about five in a row about around the same time that I was getting a four bagger and oh my gosh it's just I've never ever felt like that before and it was such a good feeling afterwards I felt so so happy I was like on top of the world it was it was brilliant and I think I was trying to work out why I was able to get that series last night and I think it was, there's been a couple of factors in that I think the major one is the fact that I've actually put on a bit of weight in the last couple of months which I didn't need to do because I was quite underweight about a year ago pretty much and you know I was just having a look at it and thinking well a year ago I was really struggling I would get tired very very easily and last night I hardly got tired at all I'm, roughly until I got near the end of the third game but I mean I just kept going I just absolutely kept going and I've never seen myself you know that happy and so so focused to just do do as well as I can and I was just extremely happy and I think another factor was that um, I think it's also because I'm in a more free kind of state of mind in that um, I was able to <coughs> not ab uh, able to just forget everything else and just concentrate on this one thing so it was good though but oh my goodness <coughs> mm, excuse me um, I'm hoping to get a couple more videos up more often, at least once a week sort of thing, so we'll see how that goes. I'm hoping to sort out the flip cam, because I'm going to be taking it with me tomorrow to Brighton. <coughs> when I go to see um, uh, my boyfriend's uh, brother's show for the Fringe, Fest uh, Fringe Festival called Spring Awakening, which is going to be interesting, but we're going to have a little muck about before we go there, so... And then of course Monday is my 20th birthday. I don't feel that I'm coming to that age at all. Like not at all. I mean, I am I am excited, but it's just weird to think that I'll be 20 in a couple of days. It's it's just mind-boggling, especially when I held my cousin's baby the other day and saw how tiny he was. It was I said, "Oh, it's just your life just flashes before your eyes like when you don't even realize how much you've actually done and it is quite shocking to me in the last like week or so because so much has happened but but still as I said I'm hoping to get more videos on YouTube eventually they'll probably be bad but as I said it's mainly for my reference but if other people like what I'm doing in my life then at least well you know it doesn't really matter what the others think but I mean as I said it's a reference to me it's me wanting to remember what I've done if there's anything significant in my life that I want to remember that you know maybe I'll lose if I had written it down in a diary sort of thing then at least I've got it here so that I can come back to it sort of thing and see you know what it was and if there was anything that goes wrong I can learn from it because, you know, that's what I've done a lot lately, you know, learned from mistakes and learned from the past and all of this, but oh, I think it's all going to go well, hopefully, so anyway, this video has dragged on for quite a long time. I'm sure a lot of people have already left, but that's fine. <laughs> so anyway, okay, I will see you guys at some point later in another video. See ya!